listening to me today, you need to understand that faith by itself is not enough. You say you have great faith, but you can't forgive me. You say you have great faith and you holding something against me. You're phony. You're fake. Your stuff is dead. Are you hearing what I'm saying to you? There's a lot of people operating in dead faith. What do you mean? They talk it, but they're not walking it. They talk it, but they're not living it. They talk it on Sunday. Everybody talks faith on Sunday. But what are you doing on Monday when, some, when someone takes your parking spot? What are you doing on, 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 on Monday when somebody slashes your tire in your neighborhood? What are you doing when, when, on, on Monday when, when someone gets credit for a job you did? Mm, dead faith. You have to not just say it, but we've got to live it also. Can you say amen to this? We must live our faith out and walk our faith out. Faith is not just a talk. Faith is also a walk. You've got to treat people right. You've got to live right. You've got to do right. You should be a person of excellence in the way that you conduct yourself, in the way that you interact with other people. You should not be backbiting and talking about people and making fun of people and acting just like the world. There should be a level of excellence about the way that you conduct yourself that when people see you, they see a standard. I want you successful as a child of God. I want you to walk in a place of privilege and in a place of honor and in a place of blessing. But child of God, you've got to understand, as we walk, there are steps we must take if we're going to get from where we are to where God wants us to be. And in taking those steps, there's going to be obstacles, there's going to be detours, there's going to be roadblocks, there's going to be spiritual potholes, if you will, that the enemy is going to try to bring in your life to trip you up. And, and trust me, if his word is a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our pathway, God will show us so that we don't have to be tripped up by the enemy. Can you say amen to that?